Så. Hello again. So, so I had a request uh, yesterday. Uh, I think it was um, to make uh, another video when I'm framing uh, uh, my flies, but more in uh, in a close up. Uh, so, so I'm using two cameras. Hopefully, they will play along. Otherwise, you can see me adjusting uh, during uh, the, the the video. So, <coughs> first of all, Paris Patu. Uh, acid free of course and uh, the reason why it should be acid free otherwise it's, it will bleach uh, the colors uh, later in the frame and you don't really want to do that well, you don't want that in a, a framed uh, a frame with a classic salmon fly because uh, they tend to be a bit expensive the, it's a lot of effort into tying a fly and uh, the material is hard to find and it could be handmade hooks whatever so you want it to really look uh, beautiful at yeah as long as possible really so I'm using some uh, brown paper a bit thicker uh, I might use actually two on top of each other uh, just to make a distance from the the paper I attach the fly to towards the passepartout in the frame so it get a bit of depth depth yeah. hard word sorry <laughs> but I, I think you know what I mean so I'm just going to have a look how many I need and then I'm just gonna glue them on the passepartout uh, immediately Yeah, and, uh, so sometimes I use strange words, uh, so I'm not a native English speaker, so that, that's uh, the issue. So uh, if there is anything you don't uh, really get, then you just add a comment and I, I can try to explain there. Because I always do my videos uh, ad hoc, no preparation, let's do this. Ooh. I don't have a uh, speech or anything prepared, so I just go with the flow. So I'm just cutting it into proper sizes. So now I know. So now I can start to glue. So I use uh, acid free glue. This one I had actually when I was in kindergarten myself a few years back. So it's it's good stuff. It's funny, it's still around. Then it's good, yeah. So so just glue two together as you can see. And then I'm not gonna let it dry. So maybe I should get some paper, just in case. Ah, uh, not the problem. It doesn't really stick on your hands anyhow. So let me remove that one. So we need to have all these. I don't wanna have any dust in the frame. So, some more glue. So in, uh, yeah, I would say one and a half day, I'm going down to Munich to the EWF fair there, the biggest one in Europe, only fly fishing, nothing else. It's a great fair in the, the Munich area. Uh, and uh, yeah, it, it's a lovely part of Germany. So it's gonna be spring for me. It's a t-shirt and shorts. They're gonna have a beer garden outside. So nice vice beer, Pringles, and of course a lot of uh, people visiting when I buy Ita flies. So it's gonna be amazing. I'm gonna make a lot of videos 
time lapse and whatever I can figure out and uh, make a video of it later and add it to, to the channel of course so, so you can see how fantastic it is so gluing the second one There we are, on the other side as well, Just let me do in the middle first. Yeah, I know, <laughs> there was a fart sound, it wasn't me, it was the glue, I promise. <laughs> I need just a little bit there I think that's okay, you don't need one more there. And then we have the base, it's almost done. So, so that's the beginning, so let's start with uh, uh, the Malayan Ranger tied on a 7 hook. So I'm just going to move this one, sorry. So then I have my paper, it's acid free paper by the way. So, I need to go and get the fly. It's over there, one second. So this one you saw me tie. Uh, I have a video on it on my channel. So, uh, just add it somewhere there. And I just put some small dots where I want to make the hole. So let's move that away. Now we're going to enlarge the holes in the paper with the needle. So I'm just pushing through and wiggle the, the needle a bit. Most of the times that, that's good enough. So 
let's do this one immediately so I'm just gonna add the needle from the back side some nice background music there and let's take the fly with this end so yes going to attach the, the gift or not attach the gift but take the uh, the thread in between the gift and the paper just need to have a look at what I'm doing on the back side so there we are <clears throat> and I always use this part as well the back side because then I can lay it flat down I can do a knot a few knots actually on the back side Then I put some, we call it tape, I think it's the same in English. And then, voila, so one side attached. So what I need to do now is to attach the, the other colors, uh, uh, since it's black hook, I'm using a black silk line. This one I need to be careful uh, tying in because uh, it has uh, feathers in the way. Yeah. 
really didn't turn out well. So let me see if it's still there. Just gonna have a look before I do anything. And yeah, not bad. So let me do another knot. So I'm gonna use more line for the next frame. Just a small reminder for myself. status look there it is everything in place perfect according to me though but uh, let's give it a try so let's take out this one put some pressure on the glow that's why I do this quick, yeah, so when I add this one then I can put on the back piece and then put it together because then the clips automatically puts them under pressure that is needed. So there you are. And now you see you have a bit of depth in the in the in the frame. So let's do this. Looks good. So I might have to open it again when when I get to to Munich because this one is uh, going to travel in the the suitcase. So basically, that, that's it. So uh, thanks, thanks a lot for watching and uh, make sure to su subscribe to my channel. And don't be shy on sharing my, my videos. And uh, I have quite a lot of other playlists, you know, classic salmon flies, predators, uh, predator flies, um, as well as, uh, you know, uh, product reviews and affairs and yeah, a lot. So make sure to subscribe. Hook me up on Instagram, Facebook, everything is going to be in the details later. So the, the sub subscribe thing is going to be here. Um, okay, enjoy. Thank you.